Hello Battletech painters, this is Travis from Renegade HBG and I wanted to give a little bit of introduction to this new painting series that I'm about to drop and give you a little bit about why this might be more beneficial for you and, uh, and exactly what to kind of expect as you go through. And so to give a little bit of history, for me, as I was learning how to paint about a year and a half ago, I think I did what was kind of typical of most people, is I came in with no clue whatsoever. It was in the middle of a pandemic, so I wasn't able to really connect with other people at the time and kind of get, you know, a face-to-face -face tutorial and guidance on this. I just kind of had to dive into all these resources that are out there in the digital world. And for me, as a visual learner and someone who learns really well by kind of the monkey see, monkey do type of mentality, um, I always came out with the, from those videos with more questions than I went in and all the little things. And for me, um, for those that don't know, I am a teacher by trade. I teach athletics and rowing in particular. And I see in the field and I see in myself, there's a tendency to forget just how much people don't know when they're just getting into. Things that you've come to take for granted or that are just automatic is when you're teaching someone, you tend to forget those little granules. And I found that a lot in all these painting videos, especially a painting video that's a 15 or 20 minute painting video for something that takes three, four hours for a new painter. And it may take that person an hour and a half, two hours to do. But for us that are just learning, it may even take eight hours. But uh, trying to condense that into a 20 minute video, might, while it may be good for kind of clickbaity stuff, you know, if you're watching this channel, you know that you know our videos aren't short, they're kind of deep, they're nuanced. There's a lot of kind of rich content in there. If you have the patience to kind of sit there and enjoy and kind of immerse yourself in the conversations. And I wanted to kind of take that mentality into a painting series. And so when I connected with Oliver, who goes by 1N51 on Twitter, um, I connected through Oliver from this piece, from his Clan Wolf Beta Galaxy Timberwolf that he had painted and shared on Twitter, which was an homage to Marco Mazzano's artwork for the Clan Invasion Kickstarter, that one from the Timberwolf sitting in front of its full arsenal. And I had reached out to him and, and Oliver offered to paint up a lot of miniatures for me. And I asked him if he wouldn't mind filming himself painting one of these miniatures from the start to the very end, all of it, all the little details. And I intended to go no cuts all the way through that process and let somebody essentially be in the role of an apprentice to a master painter and sit there and follow along with them all the way through that process from, from getting the mold lines off the miniature all the way to those final touches of putting that sealer onto the miniature. And so that's what this series is gonna be. Now, ironically, between the filming of this earlier this year and me actually getting these out, lots of people have thrown out the exact same paint scheme. Turns out it's a very popular one and a very popular miniature. Um, but I do still think that this contributes a lot more to kind of that, uh, that learning arena. And I hope you guys find it helpful. And I hope for those of you that are like me that really have those basic questions and really like to just kind of follow along and watch somebody through the process. I hope this painting series kind of resonates with you and really helps. And if it does, please put it in the comments ask questions along the way for your painting. I know I'll be there and Oliver will be kind of watching and be answering that. And it'll help inform how we wanna kind of provide that content and provide information, assuming people like this enough to do it for more paint schemes in the future. But uh, that's it, that's my introduction. I really hope you enjoy. Please um, kind of definitely send us your completed miniatures when you are finished. And, uh, and I look forward to seeing those and I look forward to kind of fielding your questions. And more than anything, I hope that it helps you get into this process with a little bit less headaches than I found myself kind of with these kind of short clickbaity type of painting videos. So that's it. Have fun. This is Travis signing off.